Hi, um, my name's Paul Wellings um, from the NME London Wide Radio and the Anti-Social Workers. Uh, the purpose of this is to give you my life story really uh, with a view to um, getting some DJ work, doing uh, one dayers, uh, festivals, weekenders, if there's any spoken word um, work going and, or also um, any, any journalism at all. So um, basically um, I was one of the original rebel pioneers of underground black music on the iconic uh, LWR pirate radio station in the late 80s. Uh, I'm a, an acclaimed author, broadcaster, journalist and spoken word artist. Uh, I attended the famous free Anna Schur Drama School in Islington, North London, where Kathy Burke, Spandau Ballets, Gary and Martin Kemp, Phil Daniels and Oscar winner uh, Daniel Kalua went. Um, I was named after the civil rights singer Paul Ro Robeson, uh, my mum's favourite. Um, I was born in the London Overspill and raised in the East End. I'm the grandson of a famously philanthropic miner and the son of public sector workers, the real heroes. In 1985, I was lucky to land a, a prestigious freelance job in the music press with the New Musical Express, the NME, thanks to the iconic editor Neil Spencer. And also, I was a, a contributor to Black Echoes magazine. Uh, I was one of the first to write about the rare groove rap scene and its links with the soccer casual movement. Um, I hate name droppers, as I told the Pope recently, but I've interviewed hundreds of diverse musicians, including James Brown, Barry White, Public Enemy, Lady Leisha, Frankie Goes to Hollywood, The Rolling Stones, The Sex Pistols, The Specials, LL Cool J, Queen Latifah, Yellow Man, Paul Weller, JCB, Natalie Cole, uh, Barry White, um, I said Barry White already, uh, Ian Jury, Norman Jay, The Wailers, Gregory Isaacs, John Martin, Ronnie Scott, and random oddities like Hollywood actor Christian Slater, activist Tony Benn, and the notorious Reggie Cray, and live to tell the tale. Um, I also worked on Mojo, The Daily Mirror, uh, The Independent and London's Evening Standard, writing about sport, music and showbiz. Uh, I've appeared on numerous TV shows discussing football, black music, uh, youth culture, um, soccer casuals and pirate radio. And I was interviewed for the major ITV music series, Soul, about underground music. In the early 80s, as a teenager, my punk reggae rap group, the Anti-Social Workers, released the LP Positive Style, produced by the legendary reggae producer, the Mad Professor, of uh, Massive Attack fame. Spitting lyrics over his dub tunes to uh, rave reviews. The group supported reggae royalty like Peter Tosh, um, Bob Marley's partner, and Eka Mouse on tour. And we did very well in the Japanese reggae charts, believe it or not. He's about to release, uh, sorry, he is, I am, about to release a follow-up album under the name um, Anti-Social Worker on m1music.com. And that will contain some original, unreleased Anti-Social Workers lyrics as well. Um, I've performed poetry with the likes of John Cooper Clark, Linton Quasi Johnson, Benjamin Zephaniah, um, I've had five books published. This is The Modern Word, which is my poetry collection. Um, I'm a journalist, Get Me Out of Here, which is a sort of autobiography about my life on the NME and the Mirror. Uh, Spend It Like Beckham about the greed in football. Uh, Sex Lines and Videotape, that was about cult movies. The Divine Comedians, about radical stand-up comedy. And um, where do I get to? And the screenplay, Thieves. Uh, for BBC's Play for Today series. But my expertise was a, as a rare groove DJ with um, with underground radio station LWR, the station that launched Radio 1's Pete Tong, uh, Carl Cox, Mr C, Westwood, Derek B and Maxi Jazz from Faithless. I inherited the name DJ Mad Hatter Paul after driving to Soul Weekenders with Trevor, Mad Hatter Nelson, um, who went to Radio 1 and he dropped a Mad Hatter tag. I've DJed at Ministry of Sound in London and Pasha in Ibiza. I was one of the first DJs to play Public Enemy and Soul to Soul on air anywhere in the world. And I was a b-boy DJ as a teenager. Now I just perform 
um, well, I just DJ, I perform spoken word, and I write when I can, and that's the kind of work I'm looking for. I'm married to the niece of the late great reggae superstar Sugar Miner. I'm fueled by socialism, the love of a good woman, and West Ham United. And you can see more of my work on YouTube or Google by searching Paul Wellings NME. So if you're interested in using me for any kind of the work I talked about, journalism, DJing, or um, you know even acting or spoken words, then get in touch.